Greetings and salutations, YouTube. This is my implementation of a cycloidal drive. If you've not heard of these before, they are a gear reducer, an alternative to something like a harmonic drive or a planetary drive. The way it works is you have an input shaft, in this case that will be coming from a stepper motor attached to an eccentric cam. And as that spins, you spin this cycloidal disc uh, the shape here is cycloidal, which moves against these stationary pins, and that produces a higher level of that multiplies the torque. So you get a slower speed of the input shaft, but you get much, much more power. The drive that's going to be made in this video will be a 21 to 1 gear reduction, and it will have a secondary disc on the back and that should help with vibrations. You have a base, yeah, so you have the motor there and then you're gonna have a base, which is this big yellow piece and that's gonna encompass the pins. On top of the base, you have this piece here which clamps down on the pins and also has space for a bearing. So the bearing will go there. That bearing will hold the output shaft which will be, that will be the inner piece and then there'll be an outer piece clamped to that. So this, so this will ultimately spin with the geared ratio of the drive. Finally, to fix all this into place, there'll be a little top cap, which is what I'm calling it. And that should fully constrain the whole drive and it'll be powered by a NEMA 17. That's the idea behind this project. Let's make this thing. 